the Council of Inner City Tribal Chiefs and Queen Mothers are traditional leaders, mostly from urban centers and zangos from across the country. They lead mostly necessitous residents within their traditional areas and vulnerable to the political knocks. Hence, the council called on the opposition leader, Mr. John Mahama, to thank him for conducting himself in a peaceful manner while in office and to further call for peace this time around as the nation gravitates towards elections. Mr. John Mahama said, Ghana is a unitary state whose guarantee of freedom of association and movement has held the fabric of society together. We've registered and voted several times in this country. And um, wherever any Ghanaian is, he's been able to register without anybody calling out his citizenship. Unfortunately, under this current administration, we had the misfortune that wide numbers of our population were questioned about their citizenship. And so if you came from Volta region and you were saying Bronga Hafu region or somewhere, they tried to prevent you from registering because they said you don't come from there. We have not resorted to any mischief making because we don't want to plunge this country into a state of, you know, a chaos. But there's a limit to which you can push people. If you continue so incompetently and on election day there is chaos and disorder and the election doesn't go well, you don't expect that we'll sit and say we accept the results of an election that does not meet the standard of an election. He said his next government will address same come January next year. Pro-opposition stations are closed arbitrarily and that is part of the environment before you go into an election. Aside from that, I mean, uh, there, there's an assault on free speech. You know, journalists are intimidated. You know, um, some journalists have been killed. Uh, whoever killed them have never been found. And there's a culture of silence returning to our country. A culture of silence that everybody fought and for which we came up with the 1992 constitution in which we had a whole chapter 12 on freedom and independence of the media. Today, ask the media people, they are afraid to broach some subjects because you get a phone call. And that is the reality that we live in. But um, we know that it is temporary and that things will change because NDC is a party that midwifed the fourth Republican democracy. Mr. John Mahama and his NDC have pledged to conduct themselves peacefully every step of the way and pray other parties do same. Ntobi Binimto, GBC News, Accra.